Hey guys, what's up? So in this game, we're going to play one of the top pick heroes in Mythic 2 and above. And it's none other than the ex-lover of Kufra, Esmeralda. She is now in the 5th place with a decent win rate of 57%. I think one of the reasons why she's on top is because of her versatility. Esmeralda can play multiple okay. roles with no problem at all, just like what I did on this game. My solo queue teammates didn't adjust, so I'll be their tank slash mage. But if you'd let me pick the best role, it has to be a side lane. Her sustain and durability allows her to dominate other fighters, no, as well as any assassin that comes to defend. In this game, I have 4 allies that are all very squishy, so that means I have to be the front of the team and initiate for them. This is where Esmeralda's passive, Star Moon Cascade, comes in handy. Each basic attack and skill deals damage twice, a physical and a magic damage. The magic damage gives the target a shield equal to 135% of it. You can use her first skill to gradually transform the shield of her nearby enemies into her own shield and then transform her shield into her HP. Esmeralda's second skill is her primary source of damage. It deals physical and magic damage to nearby enemies and also reduces their movement speed by 10% for 1.5 seconds. Hitting an enemy here war units with this skill reduces the cooldown of her first skill by 0.5 to 1.3 seconds. Anyways, this is the build that I've used in this game. I've also used the purify spell, so I won't get stuck in the middle of a team fight. So since I'm a tank slash mage, I need to provide backup on the nearest links. It's a good thing that Esmeralda's first skill has an increased movement speed that can help you switch lanes faster. Let's go back to our lane. The enemies are going to the top lane. Maybe they're planning to gank Mia. Let's go there to assist Mia and the others. Stop it, Asme. Lancelot and Natalia is trying to invade the enemy's jungle. Let's go over there. An enemy has been slain. You have slain an enemy. Has been slain. Bad, we couldn't save Lancelot in that fight, but at least we also killed the enemy's jungler. Let's people first to replenish our HP and mana. We can always go back to the lane quickly because of Esmeralda's movement speed boost. Okay, 
I thought we could destroy the tower there. Good thing I didn't die. An ally has slain the turtle! Yeah! Enemy Hang on, Zilong. Yes! The enemies really want to kill Zilong. Let's get the enemies move off. It works great with the SMS as well. And now we got the Lord. Let's try to end this game when the Lord spawns. about Esmeralda's flexibility. Victory! No, I mean versatility. Which build do you prefer? The damage or the tank build? Share your thoughts in the comment section. That's all for this video. Stay safe and thank you for watching.